a week in to keto. Have the arm still flapping a little. Arm over here still flapping. Um, side view. Tuesday morning, I am on break right now, and for breakfast, I have a hard-boiled egg, two slices of bacon. I've had one, bo one bottle of water already this morning. Um, I try to drink a bottle of water before I go to each break, so therefore, I'm not as hungry as I would be if I didn't drink anything or if I didn't finish a bottle of water. So this is what I have for breakfast. It's my boiled egg. Um, two slices of bacon this is just the smoked turkey and the mozzarella cheese and this is the green peppers and this is my lunch For dinner, I have three devil eggs, a slice of bacon, and my stuffed pepper with, um, it has meatballs and cheese and hamburger meat and everything in it. And to drink, I'm going to have a crystal light um, fruit punch, hard boiled egg, and two pieces of bacon. This is breakfast. Lunch today is smoked turkey and cheese, teriyaki and cheese, and a small salad with cheese and um, just some veggies. Two tablespoons of Italian dressing and a bottle of water, and this is lunch. Here I'm having smoked sausages that I got from Sam's. I just cut two of them up. Some radishes that I put in the oven and put some Weber garlic and herb seasoning on two devil eggs and a crystal light orange mango water. Good morning, happy Thursday. Uh, today for breakfast, I have a hard boiled egg and two slices of bacon, but I'm not really hungry. I did that workout last night, which was 53 minutes. Um, so I'm not really hungry right now. It was a really good workout. Um, I was only aiming for 20 minutes is what I was going for, but then I ended up going a little bit longer and I feel really good today. I woke up this morning with like a lot of energy um, and I figured today I'll just chat with you guys a little bit about my keto journey. Um, I did keto before. Um, I lost about 20 pounds, 20 to 25 pounds. In a course of over about three or four months and so this time and I did lazy keto like basically eating sweets and junk food and stuff on the weekends but this time I'm gonna go with no sweets no junk food no um, things that's gonna throw me out of ketosis so I'm gonna try to go at least until my birthday which is in September so this is Thursday of week one I feel really good. Haven't had any of the headaches that I would that some people have. No constipation. Um, just really good. Um, I would be lying if I said I didn't want to lose weight. Um, my goal is to lose about 40 to 50 pounds. Um, and then I'll see where I am. But just trying to get healthy for my family. Get healthy for myself. Uh, lose weight um, like I said when I'm on keto I feel really good I have a lot of energy I feel like I can do a whole lot I can run around and keep up with the boys and keep up with the family and go biking so I've been doing good I've been eating between my first break at work is 9 30 so I've been eating between 9 30 and 7 o'clock so I try to get home and eat dinner at 6, done by 6.45 on the treadmill or riding bikes by 7, 7.15 or a little bit later. And yesterday was probably about 8 o'clock. 
So I did find myself getting a little hungry right before this break. I realized that I hadn't drank enough water. So I went ahead and downed a bottle of water, which fulfilled me until this break. I did take the hard boiled egg that I had for breakfast and the two slices of bacon and cut those up and put them in the salad. So I have the small little salad and the teriyaki chicken with the smoked mozzarella cheese in the inside, two tablespoons of Italian dressing, which is really good for me because I'm usually the type of person that likes to drown their salads in dressing. So with this, I'm realizing that I don't need a whole lot of dressing, so less is more. So let me show you what. I and so this is what I have, the two tablespoons of Italian dressing and the smoked mozzarella cheese in here with the teriyaki. And this is one. Thursday's dinner, fruit punch, water, crystal light, two devil eggs, two sausages that's the remainder of the sausages and i'll do something different tomorrow's pizza day so i'll probably just eat the toppings off of pizza or make the fathead dough pizza um the leftover radishes and this is dinner tonight this is thursday's dinner so the time is now two o'clock i'm off work today that's why i didn't do a lunch and a breakfast video um it's two o'clock I'm just now finishing up planning my day of what I need to get done today um, I scrambled up an egg with some cheese I did three eggs and some cheese and five slices of bacon so let me show you what lunch is today and then tonight we're doing pizza uh, the family will have pizza and I will just have the toppings and probably a salad um, I was going to make a keto pizza, but I think I'm just going to, when they order their pizza, I'm just going to order a pizza with just the toppings. And I'll show you guys what that looks like. Let me show you lunch. And this is lunch. It's three eggs. It's either three or four eggs. I think I did four. Four eggs. It's four eggs, bacon, five slices of bacon, and some cheese, and a bottle of water. And this is lunch. So tonight is pizza night and I went to Rapid Fire and got a pizza with all toppings on a Parmesan crust and it looks so good. I think next time I'm going to get it over spinach but let me show you guys what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Oh my gosh. It's ham, bacon, sausage, pepperonis all over a Parmesan cheese crust. And it came from Rapid Fire. So very good. Ready to dig in. Happy Friday. Go to work for a few hours. Jamal went to um, Bojangles and got um, the new Mountain Dew that's at Bojangles. And um, I was looking at the menu and they have a blueberry biscuit for the fourth and I was like man that looks so good so tempted to get it but I said no I will not do it but I have a recipe for keto um, blueberry biscuits so I'm gonna try to make that now I did tweak it and turn it into my own but it was basically just simple ingredients um, you needed some blueberries baking powder vanilla sweetener almond flour but um this is what it looks like i have some in the oven already some green beans from bojangles so i'm gonna eat the green beans the leftover pizza and um the pizza toppings and i'll show y'all my show y'all my plate when everything comes out um i'm gonna start trying like a whole lot of different recipes like sweet recipes and trying to just find stuff that I like. I did find the keto ice cream. And I'll show y'all that. Hold on. So I found the keto ice cream. This one is cookie dough. And then this one is coffees and coffee and cream. So I'm hoping these are really good. I'm not a chocolate person. Like I don't like chocolate at all. So I'm hoping that I can't taste it. It says that it has very little chocolate in it. So 
hopefully it'll be okay if not i did buy the the coffee one and i'll just eat the coffee one and I so here they are out of the oven i did some muffins and i did like some smaller ones it's supposed to be like muffin tops um i took a bite of one they're not they're not bad it tastes a lot like um blueberries and almond flour which that's what they are so they're really not bad um so this is lunch leftover pizza toppings green beans that i got from bojangles and the muffin top which is not bad so it takes it makes you feel like you're eating a muffin and that's what i was going for um it's really moist and it's off in the inside blueberries are popping open i was wondering if they were going to pop open and they are popping open so so here's my dinner a piece of salmon a steak that i cut up just now some broccoli cauliflower and carrots and a salad with um mixed veggies some garlic pepper onion wedges and a little bit more than two tablespoons of thousand island dressing it's kind of hard to do two tablespoons of thousand island dressing but i'm working on it cauliflower rice with gravy hamburger steak with onions and cabbage and this is dinner tonight and a water so this is my lunch for the week this one is chicken with asparagus and it's just italian herbs um, Italian herbs and salt and pepper and then this one is I think I did hmm, oh Chicago seasoning and chicken with asparagus and then this one is peppers onions red peppers green peppers and onions and um, Chicago seasoning. And then this one is peppers, onions, um, red peppers, green peppers, onions, and this is with beer can chicken. And all of these are Weber season. And I'm just gonna stand in front of the mirror in my bedroom um, every week. This is a weekend to keto. Have the arm still flapping a little. Arm over here still flapping. Um, side view. We got the belly. This done lapped over. Got the thighs. Um, but yeah. Um, this is excuse, ex, but yeah. So this is week one into week one into keto, and I've lost um, I've lost eight pounds, which I'm very proud of myself. Lost eight pounds, um, but yeah, this is me working on it. I've just been running on the treadmill lately, running and walking on the treadmill. Um, this week going, I'm going to start the resistance bands and work on some squats. Let's see if I can get that, the, that booty to do a little bit more than what it's doing. But yeah, this is me and I'm going to, um, upload these videos every Monday for you guys. Um, so y'all can see what I ate all week. Um, let's see if I can get you a picture of the back. So I can show you what I've ate all week and, um, meal prep with me and everything. But yeah, this is me. I'm very proud of myself. Though. Like I said, this week I've lost eight pounds, whether it's water weight or inches or whatnot. I'm just very proud of myself. The fact that I'm down eight pounds from where I was and yeah.